As we continue to develop, our technological counterparts do as well. Today, most people around the world are connected to one another, but we are also connected to our technology. Our search engines have come to know us too. Google and Facebook have a specific algorithm that's set for us individually. Even dating apps know who prefers me and who I generally prefer. These all may sound like good things, great even. However, we can also say goodbye to any privacy or obscurity that one has enjoyed on the internet. We are all connected in every way, 24-7. In just a short amount of time in this world, we cannot have a right to be private. One is penalized for not sharing their data. It has become mandatory to be watched at work and even at home or anywhere. We just don't realize it. There are many apps that know where you are within seconds. It has changed the way that we communicate, use our free time, exchange money and goods, etc. Machines so far have had a very rapid introduction to our daily lives. It has invaded the very depths of our conscience. It is predicted that more work will eventually be done by machines due to their quick and fast reliability. However, I do believe that meticulous and handy craftsmanship can never be replaced in many specific fields. There are some jobs, however, that will require more machines, such as AI or artificial intelligence. There are many positive benefits, however. The best standards of living come at a price. The best technology available is more affordable for people that are richer than the average person. Wealthy people have more access to technology that is often beneficial to not only their way of living, their quality of life as well. We all deserve that. As we develop, we must set boundaries and stand up for our rights and privacy, which has been recklessly handled by rich executives and big governments, believing that they know what is best for the masses, that they are all-knowing when they really are not. We must understand that there will be no bigger presence in this world than humanity. No robot could ever take that away. We should not let big governments private corporations, or the military take away our rights to having a private presence on the internet. We should not let men in suits dictate our future, nor should we let the machines do that. Technology should help humanity advance, not fly too far into the sun and then crash into the sea. We have to think of the advancements of humanity in a more positive manner and weld our powers responsibly. While we have a lot of progression to go, we must think of three things. How will this advance us? How will this make us better? And how does this help with human progression? We can't think of machines as our slaves or vice versa. It is not impossible to have a healthy and coexistent relationship with our devices, but we must be able to make technology more affordable, as this is not only becoming a luxury to enjoy in our daily lives, but it has become a necessity to a growing and rapidly developing world. We are now centered on technology every day, whether we like it or not and we must know how to be responsible and ethical, as well as question those creating and handling these technologies. Much of us have remained oblivious to the slow takeover of our lives by technology. We are very absorbed into our daily environments. While many have become more aware of how governments and private companies, such as Facebook, Twitter, and Google, to name a few, really handle everybody's privacy. There have been many brave people who have spoken out against entities bigger than most common men among us. It has become evident that these advancements have no boundaries, morals, or ethics. They only see dollar signs. Going forward, time will only tell if humanity went through a reckless abandonment of our morals and values or if we set the correct boundaries in the beginning. We will probably never have things like privacy on the internet, not completely, and we will probably never live, not live in a state of mass surveillance and technology will only continue to develop further. Humans will always be desperate to go the extra mile and do what is beyond the horizons. And advancements should be welcome, but in a healthy way. Humans can work, humans are present, and humans are intelligent. We have the entire world at our fingertips. We can learn about awesome new things, chat with friends and family all over the world, and play any kind of game we could possibly imagine. There are many positive things that technology has introduced to daily life, such as healthcare, home finance, and anything in between. It has even helped in terms of human longevity. We know so much more than we did 5, 10, or even 50 years ago, and we can thank technology for that. 
Once you make these advancements accessible to everyone, you will finally thrive.